Hey guys, what's up? Chris here and welcome back to another episode of Can Chris Solve? Today, we're going to be taking on this guy, which is the, uh, the Twisty Skewb. I've only ever done one skew puzzle on the Can Chris Solve series, and that was the Can Chris Solve the Skewb. For those veterans of my channel, you'll know that that didn't go very well. It took me about 40 minutes to solve just one skew, so um, we'll, see, we'll see how this one goes. I do know how to solve a skew now with the one algorithm method, so we're going to try and apply it to this guy. I've not actually solved a skew in a really long time, so we'll, we'll give this a shot. We'll see if we can redeem ourselves, and we'll see if can Chris solve, if Chris can solve the twisty skew. Okay, so here we are with the skew or the twisty skew. Um, and one thing I've noticed is that we have two flat kind of centers. Now these aren't centers because it's a skew and they can kind of move around. Um, but we have the two flat sides, which is white and yellow. And they're gonna be opposite, obviously. And I'm gonna actually start with the white because it's not a twisted face. So as far as I can tell, you will do this just like a normal skew. Or will you? Yeah? Maybe so? So there's our first face uh, done. And then the next step is to put in the, the middle pieces on the other faces. And to do that, you have a really easy algorithm. Um, it's just a sledgehammer. And it just pops it right there. Uh, and it kind of swaps this one and this one as well. Uh, I didn't explain that very well. But it's a very easy skew algorithm. Basically, it moves the top piece down to the middle and it switches the left and the right pieces just with a sledgehammer. But one thing we want to be careful of is that these centers, uh, or these center pieces at least, have orientations. So if I was to put this piece down here, you can see that it's wrong. So if we did the sledgehammer that way, it wouldn't solve it. We have to do it this way. So we will do that. And as you can see, we've popped that one in. But that's just caused a couple of problems for us. Um, so what is going on here? So I'm going to take this piece out. And put it in the right place. With a nice sledgehammer. Um, then this piece can go in. And then this guy is going to go down here. Did that do it? Okay, that definitely did something, but this one piece is incorrectly flipped. So I think we can solve that very easily just by doing... Oh no, never mind. Hmm. Oh, what did I do? Did that work? Oh no. Okay, so... <laughs> what did I do? So basically I've now flipped these two incorrectly which sucks but um, what we can do is just finish off the puzzle anyway oh I've forgotten how to do this so when you get to the last layer of the skew you just do the, the sledgehammer twice at a certain angle and it will solve the top layer like it will orient them for you okay we did something so then I think you hold it like this and do the sledgehammer twice. Was I right? Yeah, cool. Okay, so we've basically solved this the twisty skew, just like a normal skew, except this guy and this guy are flipped incorrectly. Um, I'm not entirely sure how we're gonna flip them back. So let's give it, I mean, just repeating the sledgehammer a couple of times seemed to work. So we could do that one, and then come around and do it on this side. There we go. That was pretty easy, actually. Um, once you know how to apply the sledgehammer in different ways around a skew, it's actually a very easy puzzle indeed. So I had no, no real difficulty doing it on the twisty skew, because it is just a basic skew shape mod. It's very easy to do. Um, the only difficulty was the, the flipped middle pieces, and even that sorted itself out with a repeated sledgehammer algorithm. So, yeah, that was really easy. I didn't think I would have too much difficulty with it. 
I just saw that it was a skew and kind of freaked out a little bit, but that was really fun. I enjoyed that a lot. Um, it's a cool little, cool little puzzle that's not too hard to solve and, and pretty fast as well. So there it is, the twisty skew. Okay, there it is, the twisty skew. Very, very fun puzzle actually. A really cool concept. It's basically the a tons twist applied to a skew, which I think is a really neat idea. I love the a tons twist. I really like these cool, kind of quirky shape mods that are coming out at the moment. So yeah, definitely a really interesting puzzle. And even though it is a pretty easy one to solve, it's still really fun at the same time. I was sent this puzzle from magiccubemall.com a couple of weeks ago um, and it is still on sale on their site so I'll leave a link in the description below. It is really cheap, you will just have to wait a really long time for shipping because it's coming from way over in the east. But yeah, I had a lot of fun with this video actually, that was a, that was a really good puzzle to solve um, and I hope you guys have enjoyed watching me solve it. If you have, remember, leave a like, leave a comment down below and let me know which puzzles you want to see next. And then of course subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have an awesome day.